Bon Joe for JaspiesHobbyLand.com 2017 Bowman Draft Baseball Jumbo Edition. We're doing a half case random team break number 11 from a fresh case. Big thank you to all of you here for getting into this. Thank you. The combos, of course, you know by now. Orioles, Cubs, Cardinals, Nationals. We're going to randomize each list uh, five and a six, 11 times. Names first. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and eleven. The final time we've got William Mosher on the pole, and Ashley with the last spot. Mojo has the last spot. Five and a six, eleven times for the teams. One, two, three, four, and trades are allowed. Five, six. 10 and 11, although I don't see a lot of trades, but there's 11 times. Tigers down to Pirates. And let's see what everyone has. William, you have the Tigers. Rick with the Dimebacks. Chris Parent with the Twins. John Parker, you got the Marlins. William with the Padres. That's a good one. Mike Coons, Cardinals, Nationals. Angels for John Parker. Ashley with the Red Sox. Phillip with the Phillies. Darren with the Braves. Chad with the Rays. That's solid. Jake Johnson with the Mets. Rich with the White Sox, John Parker with the A's, DC with the Orioles and Cubs, Lampros with the Rangers, Reds for Colin Matoy, uh, Karen Steele, Brew Crew, Nick Sostak, Yankees, DC with the Mariners, V with the Astros, Joe Fagunis with the Indians, Kyle Plant, you got the Rockies, John Parker with the Royals, Rich with the Giants, Alfonso, Blue Jays, Anthony with my Dodgers, and Ashley with the Pittsburgh Pirates with your last spot mojo. Let's print this guy out. And feel free to trade if you'd like. Obviously, the big baseball news over the weekend. Otani signing with the Angels. The Angels winning that sweepstakes. And Giancarlo Stanton approving a trade to the Yankees. Appears as if the, uh, the, the evil Yankee empire is back. Back in full swing. All right, while people are thinking about trading, let's figure out, let's see which dice we're going to use today. Go with this one. I, I, I like the way this one feels. All right, so let's pop open this case. Let's see which half we're going to do. And the other half is already in the store. So go for it. Any trades? I don't think I see any trades, actually. Nick Sosak maybe thinking White Sox for Yankees. All right, we're going to go one, two, three for the top row of four, and four, five, six on the dice roll for the bottom. And it's going to be five. One, two, three, four, five, six. So this side up here, this will be random team 12. So I'm going to write RT12 on here so we know. We'll probably do this tonight, actually. At only 20 bucks a spot. And only 20 bucks a spot on jazbeeshobbyland.com for a half case break and the potential to find really big monster uh, prospect hits future star hits I think it's well worth the price all right I don't think there's gonna be any trade sorry Nick I think we're just gonna go TWC trade window closed so this list that you see right here remains the same. Tuesday the 12th, 12 12 today. There you have it. Like I said, the second half of the case already in the store on jazbeeshobbyland.com and check. So check it out. Another future star right here, Brandon McKay. Another two way player could potentially be in the MLB soon. Brendan McKay. He can hit, he can pitch. All right, good luck, everybody. Has there been any other big moves today? 
Chase Headley went back to the Padres, apparently, says the boss man. Let's see. I'm going to one of my favorite websites in the uh, offseason, or just in baseball in general. MLBTradeRumors.com. Orioles reportedly asking for offers on Manny Machado. Apparently the Yankees and the White Sox are interested in Machado. The Yankees aren't done yet. Cardinals, too. Cardinals apparently the favorites for Marcel Ozuna, and multiple teams are pursuing Christian Yelich. There you go. Padres acquire Chase Headley and Brian Mitchell. Mets, Rockies, Mariners, and Blue Jays interested in Jay Bruce. And then I think the other day, Phillies uh, signed Pat Neshek. Cubs are going to sign Br uh, Brandon Morrow, who was a great reliever for the Dodgers last year. Nice reclamation project. Astros still pursuing top starters. So that seems to be the buzz thus far. I think Tyler Chatwood got signed by the Cubbies too, I think. There's another bit of news there. But the big free agents haven't gone down yet. J.D. Martinez is still available. Lou Darvish still available. Jake Arrieta still available. Where do they go? Where do they go? All right. Here we go with this. Good luck, everyone. So obviously this paper, we're not shipping. The chrome stuff, we are shipping. And obviously the numbered paper cards that we see will also ship. These refractors are not numbered, by the way, in case you were wondering. It's Will Smith, big catching prospect for the Dodgers. He might be the reason why he has Monty Grandal gets moved from the Dodgers. Brandon McKay. Apparently there's a version of him as a hitter and as a pitcher. To be the next two-way player in baseball. Zach Lothar, 112 out of 399. That'll go to the Orioles, D.C., with the O's. And there's our first autograph. David Peterson for the New York Mets. Jake Johnson with the Mets. First of three autographs. 20th overall pick. That's pretty solid. Basically, in a set like this, even if you don't know, I mean, there'll be certain players where where they already have buzz, you'll recognize their names. But if you don't, basically anybody in the first round, hold on to for a little bit, see what happens. Nice. Drew Waters. Blue Wave autograph. 129 out of 150. Obviously, parallels like this, really strong. Uh, Braves, DMAC, Darren McKenzie with the Bravos. More paper. And now this paper tucked in between are numbered are in between the chrome cards. 369 out of 499 cash chase. Case. For the Reds, that'll go to Colin. There's Yuli's brother. Breeze through that paper. There's Christian Stewart. 21 out of 200. No, not the actress. Baseball player. That goes to the Tigers. That'll be for William. Yeah, that's right, Paul T. You never know 
out of all these players here, who the next Aaron Judge is going to be. This this is the kind of product where you get these autographs, and unless they're like a like a highly touted prospect from the get go that you could flip right away, this, you just hang on to him, see what happens. There's Riley Pint. He's the fourth overall pick from 2016, 88 out of 250. Nice purple paper for the Rockies. Kyle Plant with that one. So you'll see see guys like him pretty soon too. And we've got Clark Schmidt for the Yankees, 118 out of 399. For the Bronx Bombers, that'll go to Nick, Nick Sostak with that. And your autograph is Brian Miller, purple chrome for the Marlins. That'll go to John Parker. So that's out of 250, John. He's a first rounder, 36th overall, so late first round pick. We'll see what happens. Mar we might see this guy sooner than we think. The Marlins are pretty much gutting their team. So maybe you'll see the likes of Brian Miller sooner than you think. So and if he becomes, you know, part of that Marlins, that young future for the Marlins, there you go. That's a nice card on your hands. So he'll definitely have opportunities, that's for sure. That looks a little different, right? Jim Tomei? It is. Three out of five, Jim Tomei. MLB draft history. You can see the red in the background. That is strong. That is Cleveland Indians edition. That goes to Joe Fagundes. Nice. That is awesome, Joe. It's hard to get trade whistles out of this Bowman draft set. There's so many cards. But hey, you got one. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo woo! We had a couple trade whistles yesterday, too. So this Bowman draft baseball, we've been pulling some nice heat out of there. And we've got some blue paper. JB Bukowskis, 31 out of 150. 15th. Overall pick. Nice blue paper for the Astros. V with the Strohs. Breeze through this paper. And Desmond Lindsay, purple chrome. 236 out of 250. Uh, for Jake and the Mets. There you go. Nice start, boys and girls. Very nice start. All right, second box. Good luck. Cruz saying that there's two left in Court Kings. Nice. I know that Court Kings basketball will go off today. Maybe we can do that full case of Prism basketball today. Uh, We've got all sorts of things. I don't know, what else do we have on this side? We've got a lot of things on this side. We've got Star Wars Stellar. We've got Preferred Football. That's starting to gain a lot of momentum. All sorts of things. Uh, Sean, no, Hunter Green is not in this. Padres guy, right? Uh, he's not in this, but I'll tell you who is. The Another Padres draft pick is in this. No, sorry, Hunter Green is a red, but I don't think he's in this set. But who else is here for the Reds? I forget. Senzel might be in here. Actually, we should have this draft list pulled up here anyway. Oh, I was thinking of Mackenzie Gore. That's what I was thinking of for the Padres. I think the Reds, the big one, big name for the Reds. Who the, I think they have some Chris Oakey in here. Cash Case is in here for the Reds. Oh, Jeter Downs is the is the one of the bigger names for the Reds in here.
But yeah, Hunter Green, not not in this particular set. He was the uh, second overall pick. No worries, Sean. Uh, we've seen Royce Lewis. That's the number one pick for the Minnesota Twins. So yeah, Hunter Green is not in this set. Mackenzie Gore we've seen. He's the uh, Padres' third overall pick. We've seen Brent McKay. He's the fourth overall. I don't think we've seen any Kyle Wright, right? He might not be in this set. We've seen some Austin Beck. We've seen the Diamondback seventh overall pick, Paven Smith. The Phillies' eighth overall pick, uh, Adam Hazley. We've seen Adam Hazley. We've seen the number nine pick for the Brewers, Keston Huda. Uh, we saw Jordan Adele. It goes by Joe Adele in in this set for the Angels. That's the number ten overall pick. We see we've seen Jake Berger, the number eleventh overall pick. Shane Baz for the Pirates, twelfth overall pick. So yeah, we, so we've we've seen some of the bigger names here. Uh, the Yankees had Clark Schmidt this season, two thousand seventeen. Clark Schmidt, I believe he's in this set. If not as autos, I think I've at least seen parallels. Here, I'll drop the checklist for you guys, too. Actually, while I have the checklist up, I'm pretty sure Clark Schmidt has autographs in here. I know he's in the base set. He's in the chrome set. Yeah, he has autos in here. All right. There we go. Let's breeze through this paper. And our first autograph out of the second box of this break, Caden Lemons. When life gives you lemons. There's Brewers. That's for Karen Steele. Uh, I think we've pulled some Helio Ramos, right? I feel like I remember seeing him. If not an autograph, definitely some sort of parallel. But the checklist is in the chat. You can, you can confirm to see if his autographs are in there or not. A lot of names on the checklist. I've not memorized the entire checklist yet. There's Tanner Hawk out of 399. Nice for the Red Sox. Oh, it looks like Court King's divisional is sold or uh, random team sold out. That's for the Red Sox. That goes to Ashley. Uh, we should we should be able to get that done or get that started in about 20 minutes. And uh, John Parker wanted to see if people wanted to do uh, do the divisions for Court Kings, by the way. If anybody's interested in that. That's the second half of the case. First half was nice. Second half could be just as nice. Franklin Colomb for the Phillies. 25 out of 50. That card is gold for the Phillies. Phillip with the Phillies. And Jake Berger. Nice. Nice Jake Berger refractor autograph. He was the White Sox's first round pick, 11th overall, third baseman from Missouri State. The college guys are especially good to uh, good to keep track of because they're likely to get to the majors a little bit more quickly. 176 out of 49 as opposed to the high school draftees. So White Sox, Rich Schmidt, keep that guy in mind. He's got a nice autograph, so hopefully he does become a star. There's David Peterson for the Mets. Out of 499, your 20th overall pick for the Metropolitans. That'll be for Jake. All right, there you go. Off 
here. And there's Vladimir Guerrero Jr. I think that's a that's not a that's a facsimile autograph, by the way. So you can see all the tops ones, with all the regular autographs say top certified autograph issue. This is just a facsimile, but it's a really short printed card, from what I understand. Alfonso with the Blue Jays. So there you go. Nice one, Alfonso. paper. There's your first overall pick. Haven't seen his autograph in a while. And the last stack where you should be expecting one more autograph out of this stack. And there he is, Blake Hunt. That's a fryer. That'll go to William Mosher. Nice. Padre is quietly building a nice young team as well. Paper. Where's that autograph? There's purple paper. There's Vladimir Guerrero Jr. Another Vlad Guerrero Jr. Purple paper. Another one for Alfonso. there. Green autograph? No, green parallel. Oh, there it is. Yeah, okay. So Hunt is my last autograph. <laughs> Sorry, guys. 38 out of 99. Green chrome. That's our last parallel then. That goes to the Indians. That'll go to Joe Fagundis. There you go. There are three. All right, two boxes to go. Now remember, the second half of this case is in the store, jazbeeshobbyland.com. A lot of big monster prospects coming up the pipeline, ladies and gentlemen. And it seems like a lot of teams, even though you know there'll be big free agents and whatnot, a lot of teams are really committed to building from the farm system, building from within. So a lot of these players you're going to see uh, come marching up the ranks for a lot of baseball teams. And probably stay with their parent club, you know. Like the Astros drafted a lot of their young guys. You see them coming up the ranks. You see them go, going, uh, you know, winning the World Series. You know, you see the Dodgers going to the World Series with their young core. You see, that's what the Red Sox are trying to do. You know, that's what a lot of teams are trying to do. A lot more emphasis than usual on building from the ground up. And then supplementing it with, you know, the big free agents and whatnot. But everyone's really committed to doing that these days, even more so than it seems in recent years. All right, good luck, everybody. Breeze through that paper. There's Adam Hazley. 402 out of 499, your eighth overall pick. Silver paper, or just regular paper parallel. For the Phillies, that goes to Phil on the Phillies. Troy Bacon, 
122 out of 399. Wish I had like bacon. Wish like burger. Jake Burger would come out here next. Braves. That'll go to Darren McKenzie. Then I could say bacon burger. There's a bacon in basketball too, I think, right? We got Dalton Varsho for the Diamondbacks. One out of 150. The first one ever made. Blue paper going to Rick and the Diamondbacks. Second round pick. And there is our first autograph from this box, Griffin Canning. Los Angeles, California, Angels of Anaheim in Orange County. Of Anaheim in Los Angeles. 34 out of 499. That goes to John Parker. It's Dwayne Bacon. That's right, Aiden. It's Dwayne Bacon. The good kind, boy. <laughs> More paper here. Doesn't really matter, does it? Ernie Clement, 161 out of 499. That's for the tribe. That goes to Joe Fagundis. More paper here. Let's breeze through that. There's Ramos right there. And there's Will Smith, big catching prospect for the Dodgers, 112 out of 150. Pretty excited about him. And Austin Barnes. Dodgers, Anthony. And Cade McClure. No relation to Troy McClure, I think. Hi, I'm Troy McClure. White Sox. That'll go to Rich and the White Sox. And there's our third autograph, Drew Waters for the Braves. That'll go to Darren McKenzie. Second round pick. So we got our three autographs. Sometimes we, we've seen bonus autographs before. So that's a possibility. We've seen four of these boxes. Maybe we'll see one here. Maybe we'll also uh, maybe see a really low number parallel too. We saw a couple red parallels yesterday, which is pretty awesome. There's Lazarito Armanteros, 60 out of 99, green paper for the A's. John Parker with the A's. Oh, we got some gold coming up. Ooh, there's a bonus auto right there. Gold Wave, Stuart Fairchild. This, I, I felt like there was going to be a bonus auto here. Seven out of 50 for the Red Legs, Colin Matoy. There it is, Colin. Nice. Seven out of 50. 38th overall pick, second rounder, outfielder. There you go, consensus freshman All-American in 2015. Nice, power speed threat with high baseball IQ. 
and, and it just looks cool. Can't complain about a bonus auto like that. Nice, congrats. All right, well, let's breeze through this paper. We'll get to the last box. Kevin Maiton, this is still Braves edition of Kevin Maiton, purple chrome. That'll go to Darren McKenzie, that's out of 250. With the Angels now. Sounds like a big move for the Angels. Are going to do well next year. Yeah, I mean, they did well last year, you know, yeah. with like with Mike Trout out for two months. Yeah. Now you got like a pretty much a frontline starting pitcher, yep. possible DH right there. Oh, he is? Oh, he is? So, where, 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 what's Pools going to do? Uh, uh, <laughs> gets, gets, a, gets a nice handshake. A, a nice watch. Thank you for your service. Gets traded, maybe part timer. All right, boss man. I'll see you tomorrow. Yeah, no Mason House yet, Michael House. Michael House was saying earlier he hopes that Mason House becomes a Hall of Famer. You'd be able to get that jersey, MH. Get that, get that house jersey. That'd be awesome. Oh, okay, nice. All right, last box, folks. Then we'll put this away, and then we'll do, uh, and we'll do court kings. We'll do the court kings after this. And then I don't know what else we're gonna do. We'll see. Good luck, everybody. Last box. Three more autographs, bunch of parallels. Maybe another train whistle. We'll see. Stay tuned. Never know. Although I don't see any red peeking out of there, but Michael Kopeck, the fireballer, uh, three ninety nine. White Sox, that'll be for Rich. paper. And Riley Mahan is your first autograph out of our last box. Marlins, John Parker with the Marlins. There you go. You might see this guy pretty soon. You never know. They don't have D. Gordon anymore, John Parker. Might see that guy sooner rather than later for the Marlins. Kyle Wright, green chrome autograph for the Bravos. Another one for Darren McKenzie. Twenty-four out of ninety-nine. Fifth overall pick. That's a strong one. Fifth overall pick from Vanderbilt. Nice. Vanderbilt has a great baseball program. I think the next big name for the Dodgers will be Walker Bueller, who is uh, from Vanderbilt. We got Bubba, Bubba Thompson, 479 out of 499. Texas Rangers, Lampros, with the late first round pick.
And Vladimir Gutierrez, green chrome for the Reds. That'll be for Colin. 96 out of 99. here looking for one more autograph and some more parallels of course there's Brendan McKay that is strong 296 out of 399 your fourth overall pick a premium two-way threat there it is could hit for power can pitch too Tampa Bay Rays, Chad with Brandon. There's Mason House. Purple Paper, Tyler Ivey. Out of 250, 31 out of 250 for the Astros. That'll be for V. Not an autograph. I was thinking that was going to be it. AJ Puckett, 131 out of 200. Rich with the White Sox. Another parallel for you. There it is. I was getting nervous. Morgan Cooper. Morgan Cooper with a nice autograph, too. Anthony with Morgan Cooper for my Los Angeles dog. I don't really know much about Morgan Cooper, but that's why we have these the backs of these cards. Uh-huh. Collegiate 13. Okay. That's a good K per nine rate. I dig that. Four pitches at rate above average. Good speed. Got the Tommy John knocked out. All right. There you go. We'll see what happens. Might see him sooner rather than later for the college guys. And that's it, folks. And Scott Hurst at the end. Joe for jazbeeshobbyland.com finishing up Bowman Draft Baseball. That was the first half of the case, second half of the case in the store right now. So check it out on jazbeeshobbyland.com. We can pull more monsters out of here. Thanks very much, everyone. Let's go prospecting. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.